Thank you, BMI, for this beautiful award. It's such an honor to receive it. And thank you to everyone who supported my work on Promising Young Women. As the world caught on, it all happened because of Emerald's brilliant film, which I hope will forever change the way we behave to one another. As part of BMI's How I Wrote That, I wanted to talk a little bit about the theme that I wrote for Emerald's protagonist, Cassie. Emerald and music supervisor Sue Jacobs asked me to see if I could find a through line and sent me the film to see what I'd come back with. As I watched it, I was so inspired by Carrie Mulligan's amazing performance. Cassie's life has been set on an axis after losing her friend Nina. While Nina doesn't specifically appear in the film, she's the whole reason it exists. And so what I wrote was a lullaby for lost friendship between Cassie and Nina, which, in its essence, could be open, rising and hopeful, but could also be haunted, subverted and dark, as we learn more about what happened to Nina, Al Monroe, and Cassie's past in college. I sent the theme to Emerald, and that's how I found myself in the very fortunate position as the film's composer. It was also really useful to be able to use the first two notes of the theme as an accompaniment, or just a subtle way to evoke Nina's presence. And I also used it with different harmony for Cassie's romantic adventure with Roy, where Nina is ever present. And so that's how I wrote that. And a huge thank you to Emerald, Carrie and Sue for inspiring the theme and sending me on that journey. <laughs>